After Janice and I checked into our hotel, the Boston Park Plaza, we texted Simone to find a good place to meet up and to meet Ariana, our good friends from Singalia, Italy. After a brief meetup and some small talk, we had to find a good place to eat. We decided to take a very long and, well, somewhat luxurious walk along Commonwealth Avenue on our way to see Harvard University. This lovely little fixer-upper in the area of Cambridge was going for the bargain basement price of $2 million. What do they say? Location, location, location. The three lies of Harvard University. Number one, this isn't a statue of John Harvard, even though his name is on the base. John Harvard wasn't the founder of Harvard University, and Harvard University was not founded in 1638.
करो थैंक यू We took a different route on our way back, primarily so we could go by Fenway Park and check out the scene there. There was a game later that night and they had the streets blocked off. Uh, one area was blocked off for the athletes to park, yeah, but we did not stick around and wait for that. It was starting to get kind of crowded. But we were putting in about 25 to 30,000 steps every day, so that's the reason why you see all of the food. Ariana wanted to try a good old fashioned American hamburger and we were told that the Capital Burger was one of the best in Boston and we were not disappointed. The following morning we took a short drive to Portsmouth, New Hampshire to check out the sights there and we wanted some breakfast and Ariana wanted to experience some good old fashioned American pancakes so we found the Sunrise Grill and they offered a great variety of different styles of pancakes. place to spend the day is at the Strawberry Bank Museum. This is what they call a living museum where all the people there are in character and in period correct clothing. But be careful. If you ask to take a photo, they may say something like, I don't have time for a sketch or a drawing. So they do try to stay in character and sometimes you may feel like you went back in time. Well, of course, we walked around town long enough and far enough that we worked up another appetite, and so we tried the river house for some seafood and the views along the river. following day, we took a leisure drive up to Portland, Maine to tour the town there. Ariana wanted to try another American staple, the hot dog. We found this little place and the hot dogs there were wonderful.
kill a little time while we're waiting on our order. We saw this sitting on the shelf. I haven't seen a Rock'em Sock'em robot game in years. Ariana didn't know how to play the game, so thought I'd give her a little lesson in Rock'em Sock'em Robots. I did win, however, I have played the game before.